Hey, hey, the cafe is open! <laughs> Now then, this is the start of our book tour for the book How to Live Vegan. We're very excited. Very excited indeed. And the reason why we're excited is because of this. Check this out. Check out this. How cool it is. Watch out, watch out. Motorbike. Check this bad boy out. Wow. That is the How to Live Vegan car, as you do. You know. AKA the Boschmobile. Boom. It's an electric car, because you know, it's all about sustainability. We're working with Renault, so they thought they'd cover it in Bosch illustrations. Doesn't that look cool? So we're going all over the UK in our Renault electric Zoe, and the first stop is Tottenham Court Road, Waterstones. We'll be there at 7.30. It's gonna be a wicked night. Nothing else to say, is there? Just shut <laughs> the We're about halfway up to Sheffield, which is today's tour date, and we've had to stop so that we can charge this little bad boy up. We've been here for around about 40 minutes, and now we have four minutes left, and we have a full charge. We've had a coffee, we've had a chat, we've had a chill, no problem whatsoever. So we've arrived in Sheffield. The Bossmobile is looking real, real good. Look at that. <laughs> we just had a little impromptu photo shoot. And the really cool thing is that this gorgeous building where we're going to be doing our talk later on is called Firth Court. My surname is Firth. Nice touch, guys. Nice touch. <laughs> This is definitely the poshest green room I think we've ever been in. Look at this. Well, you could be in a really fantastic church, but indeed we are in Sheffield University and this is the main hall of the Firth building and this is where we are going to be doing our talk for Off The Shelf Festival. Very proud to be here, this is amazing. Who are we doing it with? We are doing it with the wonderful Pauline, or Paulette from- Paulette, um, Paulette. Yeah, Paulette from Radio <laughs> There's Checker. Paulette. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I'm here. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you psyched? This is an amazing, amazing dress you've got Thank on. Thank you very much. Yeah. Isn't it incredible? It's the end of the summer dress. I thought I'm, I'm nice. going to save it yeah. until next year. It's, it's, it's cold here, though. Know. Getting somewhere now, Ian. I thought, <laughs> I thought, I thought I'll like, give it a bit of art. Good so skills. <laughs> Sunday and we've decided to come to the countryside in Sheffield. Yay! Yay! And we are hunting for a roast dinner. Mm -hmm. Vegan obviously because it's Sunday and that's what we do. And we found a vegan roast dinner at Fox House which is in this gorgeous rolling beautiful valley of the Peak District. Mm -hmm. Look at these hills. Beautiful eh? 
Well, actually, yes, this is just a car park. I'll give you that. But this is a car park in the countryside. That's Fox House. They do vegan roasts. We're going for one of them later on, which is going to be really cool. But meanwhile, we're going to have a little stroll around and just check out the view. Also, I just got a new toy. And this is a new toy over here. <laughs> it's called the Insta360 One. It's like a 360 camera on a selfie stick that lets you get like 360 footage all around you. It's gonna be really cool. Charlie, our editor was going on about it. And we're gonna do a little B-roll section right now to show you how it works. You excited, MJ? Excited, MJ? You excited, MJ? So excited. Whoa. gorgeous to get out in the hills of Sheffield. So nice as well whilst we're um, on this manic tour whizzing all the way around the UK in this electric car. So this has been a lovely day off. Now we're going to head inside that pub, the Fox House, and check out how good their vegan roast is. Look, it's my mum. Hello, mummy! One of those weird walk up the escalator moments where the escalator isn't working. We have just arrived at Waterstones and they've asked us if we'll cut the ribbon to open their new cafe. That's got to be an honour, right? <laughs> so uh, before our little talk and Q&A, we're going to do some ribbon cutting. That's definitely a first time. I've never done that before. Hey, hey the cafe is open! It's the lick, it's the lick, it's the lick! This is the cafe. This is a really good sign. They needed more chairs because more people have just turned up. Very happy about that. Normally it's the other way around, isn't it? It is. Usually it is, but apparently the people of Nottingham are coming through. Woohoo! Now the question is, how cute was that little doggy with the uh, wheels? Yeah, the doggy was like um, a living, breathing cloud. So beautiful. Fluffy. Really fluffy. And rescued from South Korea by two lovely ladies who go over there, rescue animals every year. And they invited us to go to South Korea, maybe we should go. Let's do it. <laughs> right, next stop, back to London in the electric car. Woo The actual sea. How cool is that? We're at Waterstones again. It's like a tour of Waterstones. We drove here in our lecky, ready for another tour. We've just done a bit of a podcast with the Delicious, which was delicious. It was fun. We talked about lots of Christmassy things. Yeah. And we just got an incredible sunset time lapse. Oh Check this out. God. Right, enough looking at sunsets, enough hobnobbing. We need to go and chat to some of these people. I know, Brighton people don't wait for nothing, so we better get going and chatting.
11.45 at night, just got back from Brighton and we're off at eight o'clock in the morning for three days more of this tour. Whew, there's a lot going on. So our pal Miguel Barclay told me that we're the hardest working men in food. And another morning is 8.15 a.m. We're supposed to leave at eight, but we didn't get back till midnight. So I kind of feel like, you know what? On this tour, yeah. he's been proved right at about six hours sleep. And now we're off to Soho Farmhouse. The tour continues after that wonderful, wonderful drive. First off, we went to Oxford, where we did a little live link up on the BBC Radio Oxford. You know, so many people were asking us how we went vegan, why we went vegan, what should they do about protein, what should they do about B12, where did we get our vitamins from, what about leather belts? There were so many questions that kept coming in via Facebook and Instagram and from people who'd read our books. We just thought we should answer them all. Then, what did we do next? So we drove here. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, we're just outside of Chipping Morton. Uh, a very nice place called the Soho Farmhouse, which is essentially, it's like a members only holiday village and we're here with Facebook wrapped on a panel, which is really cool. We're now in Cardiff. Yes, we are Cardiff Navinhibful and looks like a wonderful city. Yeah, it looks gorgeous, yeah. doesn't it? We were at the Soho Farmhouse in Oxford. We hit some pretty significant traffic, so we are going to be there by the skin of our teeth. <laughs> and as you know, we've driven all over the country today in this electric car. There's been traffic, there's been trials, there have been tribulations, <laughs> and we've done yeah. Oxford, Chipping Norton and now Cardiff all in one day. This has got to be the most bonkers day of the whole tour. Oh, without question. <laughs> Arguably the most bonkers day of life. But here we are. And here we are. The lovely Sarah is guiding us. Waterstones. We're here at Waterstones. Life is good. Hello. Hello, you lovely yeah, people. Hi, right. I'm Henry. Technically on time? Just, <laughs> just. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Smells like books. Hello everyone. Hi. Uh, yeah. Right, that's done. We have just had the most lovely time at Cardiff. Wasn't that nice? That was incredible. Yeah. yeah. The wonderful Claire was interviewing us and we had a room full of really, really nice people. We were bang on time. Like there was no in between. It was like it was like bang on the minute. We strolled in here and everyone's like, hi, and we're like, hi, and we cracked straight on and it was wonderful. What did you think, Claire? Best I moment. thought, oh, best moment. Um, you said it felt like a sport week, didn't you? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, we were all, it was like a chat, and um, I think you went and played with a lot of converted people. There you go. Awesome. And now we need to go away with a beer. Yes. Because we've had a bit of a day of it. It's been a busy day. Food, beer, bed. Food. This is Cheltenham. Welcome. We're in this incredible place called the Daffodil and we're gonna host about 95 people come to eat food from Bish Bash Bosh. Then of course, we're gonna do a Q&A. We've done quite a few of them already and a book signing for our new book, How to Live Vegan. This place is unbelievable. Ian's been rambling about it for about the last 15 minutes. Go on Ian, I know you're dying to tell them <laughs> about this amazing building. Cool. So we've been in Cheltenham now for about the past few hours. We hold up, did a bit of work, but I'll tell you something, this town city has got some wonderful buildings and this is definitely one of the best. This is an old cinema. It was built in the 1920s and it's just grand. It's got this wonderful sort of art deco newness. Look at these metal kind of um, light fixtures. And you can imagine the sort of stuff that was going on here back in the day. You'd have like wonderful kind of like long dressed women with those really short sort of tidy haircuts, smoking those cigarettes that are really long or like getting down and early. <laughs> it would be really amazing. And it's going to be really amazing tonight. I'm really looking forward to it. This is the best venue of the whole tour by far. Look, there's loads of people outside waiting to come in. Oh, it smells very hot. Look at that. Oh, here he goes. Oh, oh beautiful. Oh, thick and gloopy. Perfect. Top man. Well Good work. <laughs>
And that was Cheltenham. Oh my goodness me, what a wonderful town. And what a wonderful tour this is proving to be. It's so good just chatting to people face to face. It's great with social media, but the one-to-one -one connection that you get with people when you're in a room with them is just wonderful. This book is giving us loads of talking points and everyone seems to love it, which is great. Next stop is Stroud. And I personally cannot wait. Let's go. Wow, hello, welcome to Stroud. Yes, the final leg of the How to Live Vegan book tour is upon us. So we're here at the Stroud Brewery. We've just driven about three hours to get here. In fact, the person who gave us directions sent us completely the wrong way. Cheers for that. But you know what, it was a great drive because we were in our Renault Zoe. Thank you Renault for lending it us. It's been a pleasure driving it about. So there's a load of chefs in there that have cooked a load of our Bosch recipes. That's really cool. We're gonna go meet loads of people. Apparently the local news team from ITV are here. Ooh. And we've got a Q&A and a signing. Yeah, man. The last tour, can you believe it's over? Ah, we've been everywhere. <laughs> we've been all over the place ah. and that's coming to an end. I know, it's kind of bittersweet really. I've really enjoyed it. Yeah, it's been good. So if you've come to see us on the tour, thank you very much. We appreciate that. Right, enough chat. Let's go do this. See the shadow? <laughs> <laughs> what a doofus. Oh yeah, what a doofus. Hello once more. Hello, hello. What's here? So this is a smoked watermelon tartar. It's supposed to taste like a smoked salmon and it's on a sourdough toast. Uh, so this is a fermented tomato crostini with hummus. This is again the taco. This is a, a jackfruit wing. Are they fish jackfruit wings per chance? <laughs> Have they got, has it got a, a sugar cane bone inside? It has, it does, it's amazing. Oh, amazing! Yeah, it's really cool. Uh, and these are wild mushroom gyozas. So this has been Stroud, we've just finished our book tour, hope you've all enjoyed watching this video, obviously like, comment, subscribe, all of that good stuff, and we'll see you next time. One more thing to do, bish, bash, bash! That was amazing! <laughs> Thank you all very much! <laughs> Thank you both. Absolutely banging.